I don't really, and I've never really resonated with the title of teacher, um, although I am, and I've taught a lot of people a lot of things. Mm. I, I, I think I prefer to, to, I've always preferred to look at myself as an artist and an artist who, you know, knows a thing or two and is able to communicate that well with other people. I enjoy art in many different forms. I enjoy taking someone from like being completely shit to like actually being like really good. Like, mm. I, like and that, that I've done a lot of times. And I enjoy seeing people at those breakthrough moments. Like I had one a couple of weekends ago. I was doing a weekend intensive and um, I won't I won't say her name just in case, but like she, you know, she trained at she trained at Arts Ed and like she'd been acting for a while and I just did this exercise that you've probably seen me do where I'm just like, let's just say the lines to one another. Yeah, and I, I actually it. I actually did the script with her. because mm-hmm. um, sometimes I find when I jump in as an actor, because I do really talk to people for real, it makes them talk for real as mm-hmm. well. And I think it just encourages a little bit. Sometimes when I have two people and they're not talking to it, then it takes longer. So I was like, let me just jump in. And I did it with, I only had five people in the workshop. So I just jumped in with them and I just sort of like, let's just say these lines. Yeah. And we did it. And then I said, right, like, you know, let's just progress it a little bit and let's put a bit of an intention in it. And then maybe on rehearsal three, she just had this like emotional breakthrough. She genuinely started to get upset. I could see the tears coming in into her eyes. And she was like, and I caught it. And we were only doing sort of three lines back and forth. And she was like, oh my God, like, I actually felt something for real that's never happened mm-hmm. before. And I'm like, there you are. That's it. That's mm-hmm. what we're here for. That's what I'm here for. Mm-hmm. That's why I'm doing it. I'm not doing it for any other reason. Do you know what I mean? Like, that's, you just had a real connection. You just had a real connection with yourself. You just felt something real out of nothing. Mm-hmm. And all we did was put you in a place where you felt connected to yourself and you felt comfortable in your own skin enough to just be like, I'm just going to say these lines to this person. Mm-hmm. And that's when the fucking beautiful stuff happens. And that's why I keep doing it. Because when I see it happen and when I feel it, it's just mm-hmm. like, that's sick, you know? And I'm facilitating that. I'm, I'm making that happen for people. Um, and I think that's deeper than being a teacher. I mean, that is like, that is being a teacher. I'm teaching people how to do it. But I'm, in a way, I'm fucking like, I don't know. I'm, I'm helping to, I, I feel like at least that I'm helping to guide people to a place of like feeling more secure in who they are. And that's like, that's a sick thing to do, you know? Like, yeah. what a nice way to, to live a life. <laughs> yeah, yeah, um, totally right. So it's not like, oh, I'm an acting teacher, yay. Like, mm-hmm. I don't really, I'm like, nah. <laughs> you know, I'm not, that's not really like what I see myself as. Mm. Um, yeah. So it's more like for you, it's more like collaboration in a way. Just artistic collaboration, just, you know, help, helping people grow. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Like, mm. this is the script we're working on. We've got these two pages to work on for three hours. Mm. Obviously, everyone always gets up and has a go. Um, and that's something I've always been really like, um, sort of precious about. Obviously, being an actor myself, I don't want to go to a workshop and not do any acting. I don't. I don't want to fucking sit in a workshop for three hours and only do two minutes of acting. Yeah. I, I've done it myself. I've done it plenty of times, and, and sometimes there is value in it. But if I'm paying thirty-five quid a week for a class. I want to be doing some fucking acting, mm. you know? <laughs> yeah. Um, so, yeah, that's sort of like, right, this is the material. How can we, how can we get into this? But how can we get into it in a way that feels right for us as the individual? Like, how can we make it our own? Like, I love those classes when I see seven different interpretations of the script. It's the exact same writing, you know? Mm -hmm. And I see seven or eight completely different interpretations of it. Like, everybody brings their own thing to the table. And they're still, like, on the objective. And they're still on objective. It still makes sense. Yeah. And it's like, oh, that could be a version of the film in itself. That could be a version. And Mm -hmm. it's just like, we've got all these different fucking interpretations of the work. And I'm just like, wow, like that. That's Mm -hmm. amazing. Mm. Um... And that, I guess that comes into what you're saying about the collaboration side of things. It's like, yeah, I'm sort of getting to them, work with that and say, oh, maybe we push it like this, hey, I'm gonna push it like that. And then that's more my, my directing side of things, mm. which I am, um, you know, passionate about.